here's something that confuses me. You're gonna hear, listen to. This. I thought the only way you can get sins forgiven is by the blood, by the blood, by the blood. It says it in the Talmud. Without the shedding, I've heard. I've, I haven't seen it myself, but I've heard that the Talmud said, the Jewish Talmud says, without the shedding of the blood, you, you need blood to be forgiven. We know it says in the New Testament, without shedding of blood is no remission. What does this mean? Listen to this. It shall not be forgotten, and instead of sins, it shall be added to build thee up. In the day of thine affliction, it shall be remembered. Thy sins also shall melt away as the ice in the fair warm weather. For doing good deeds, how come... So many people in the Old Testament, even Polycarp, whatever, believed you get good deeds, alms, took away sins. What does that mean? What does that mean? I thought only the blood of Jesus could cleanse sin. Jesus, are you real? Why is the theology of the day yesterday a little different from the theology of the day?